Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. This is Aries the Emperor. Thank you all so very much for joining me on this very beautiful afternoon, evening, morning, wherever you are in the world right now, welcome, okay? This is an all Aries channel for all Aries placements. Cross watchers are welcome as well. And I say all Aries as in everyone has a little bit of fire, Mars in their natal birth chart. Um, so if this message resonates with you, welcome, join us, okay? Thank you guys to everyone who has liked and subscribed to the channel, everyone who has donated, booked a personal reading. Um, readings have been sent out. If you purchase, check your email and also check your emails as well because there is additional information that I may need from you all. So make sure you're checking your emails so that we can connect, okay? As well as um, thank you guys for shopping at the candle shop, ariestheemperor.com. I'll leave all of my info in the description box. All candles are 100% soy, vegan, um, so check them out, you guys. Um, go check them out. All right, let's jump right on in. So I was feeling the energy of, you know, and this message may or may not resonate with everyone, you guys. So just take what does and leave what does not. Place the gender roles where they need to be for you. This is energy and energy is all fluid. So I just wanted to put it out there, like bluntly as I can. Sometimes your best is not good enough. Eight of Cups. Uh, no matter how you dress it up, how you fix it up, how you remix it, if they don't want it, you know, they just don't want it. But that doesn't mean that you need to get rid of it. You know, especially if it's something that is attached to you, something that comes from you. You know, it's people out there that really hate themselves so much so that they want you to feel it. You know, they want you to see it so that it hurts you. They want you to live in it. It's pain. You know, that place isn't for you, collective, though you may be familiar with it. Um, no more will you suffer from it. If it's one thing I've learned is, you know, people out here in this world, they can dish it but majority of them cannot take it. And I feel like you have not been someone who has dished it. Um, maybe you're someone who's been backed into a corner before and you've just had to defend yourself. But I do feel like when it is time for you to actually give it, you know, they just, they may not be ready. All right, three of wands. This is Sagittarius energy. Give me one second here as I have one card fly off the table. Oh, guess what flew off the table, Collective? The Emperor. Okay, so like I mentioned, you may be familiar with the outskirts. You know, but it is not where you are meant to be. You know, you are meant to be on your throne here. You know, gazing out on the distance. You know, thinking about your next move, your next adventure. You know, your next moment to conquer and to achieve, you know, whatever goal it is in life that you are chasing whatever liberation, whatever simulation. Um, I, I just see you you taking position here and really standing on it, really sitting in it here um, as the year begins to progress here. Three of Pentacles, okay, coming together, communicating, networking, building for a better cause here. Is that Aquarius energy, um, that humanitarian energy, so to speak here. I feel like you're very loving, but going forward, there are a lot of things you're going to have to put your foot down on. Um, just a lot of things that were, look like may have been growing in a better position, um, so to speak. If if it's not by a certain point of time, I see you deading it. I see you cutting it off. I see you separating yourself. 
And this is like how they, they say in the movies, you know, this is separating the men from the boys, you know, the, the girls from the women here. And this year is going to make or break somebody. I really feel like it, you know, contemplating and perfecting yourself, building yourself, you know, growing your spirituality and something is going to pay off for you. Two of Pentacles. Thank you, Spirit. Whether it's multiple streams of income, some your ships are coming in for you is basically what this is saying. Justice at the bottom of the deck. I can't make this up. You're just due. You know, you've been in the trenches. You've been getting dirty. You know, it's, it's been crabs in a bucket. Like, they've been trying to pull you down. They've been eyeing your prize. They've been envying you they've been looking at you and see as a piece of meat you know how can they 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 tear you apart you know i feel like you're up against people who fight dirty people who want to win at all costs but don't even understand what they're actually fighting for you know people that really in real life wouldn't you know, bust a grape in a fruit fight. You know, this this is an uh, energy that I'm getting of you. Like, you really are somebody who have been to war and back. Earn your stripes. And uh, you're on a new timeline here. You know, this one is one of growth and, and one of image and one of polishing as you grow and continue to conquer, I feel like. Big moves for somebody. Big moves is what I'm getting here. More money coming in for you, especially here. You know, updated wardrobe is what I'm getting. Uh, even an extra vacation here is, is also what I'm seeing. Eight of swords. Three of cups at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, this is good conversation. Um, this is coming together with people that are good for you, that are healthy for you. You're not the people that are going to make you second guess yourself or, you know, energies that are going to make, make you second guess who you are. Um, and if your goals are even valid, you know, you don't want to separate yourself around energies like that or people who are going to make you feel and question yourself. way too many it's just kind of all flew out these cards are new by the way bright pink <laughs> and i think i still have them upside down okay so the nine of wands popped out and this is what I was speaking about, that emperor energy going forward. You really protecting yourself and putting up boundaries for good reason. Let me tell you something. The emperor is an energy of so exclusive that you don't get to pick and choose if you want to see the emperor. You know, you're lucky if the emperor gives you an opportunity to even grace <laughs> grace uh with your presence okay even though this is an energy so to speak you know that this is you here alive and in charge and not only are you in charge but nobody's gonna break you and nobody is getting past what you have built here it's like sorry not sorry okay you can feel how you want to feel about it going forward but if it's about your money you know you ready to cut people loose and keep it moving Oh my gosh, that's the Ten of Cups that flew over there, you guys. I'm not going to get it this time because it flew across the room. But we have the Nine of Wands, the Four of Wands, the King of Pentacles, the Page of Cups, and the Ten of Cups flew over. The Magician is what you don't see coming at the bottom of the deck. So for me, this energy is just you really finding your purpose and i feel like not just finding a purpose but you really finding an avenue of stability for you this go around and it being lucrative for you you being able to experience fabrics you've never experienced before i'm hearing maybe like beauty products um it's just there's going to be a, a growth to you that is one of reaching new heights stepping into a new level here 
Page of Cups is um, an emotional offer of some sort, maybe some type of news that needs to come in or someone wants to come in, a water sign here. Possibly someone who's been thinking about you or just overthinking the way that they uh, treated you here. This doesn't have to be that zodiac sign, um, but I, I feel like somebody is more serious in their thoughts about you here. Uh, whether this is a relationship wise or uh, just friendship there's now a stability or there's this essence about you that is being looked at as someone to settle down with you know a total package type of thing someone to build an empire with is what i'm getting from this and somebody who is um on their job you know you are taking care of business here Justice and the Magician card, Aries energy, more Aries energy. That's that fire energy. So this year is a year that's supposed to be your best Aries. So with the Magician energy here, the Magician has every tool that there is in the tarot deck. He has the sword, the cup, the pinnacle, and the wand. So for me, this is spirit speaking volumes to you and, and letting you know I'm putting everything on the table for you. Literally, Aries, look at all of this on the table for you. So there's no way for you to fuck this up. It's literally what spirit is saying to me here, okay? So you're being walked through this, all right? Blueprinted, justice here. This is good karma, all right? The devil card is what you don't see coming at the bottom of the deck, all right? This is negative relationships, like I mentioned, that somebody here is now upset and could possibly still try to want to come in and be bound to you here. But this is also material focus, materialism. Um, this is greed in a, in a sense as well. So just be careful as you grow, as you acquire more things, as you become more of a connoisseur in the world um, and your tastes change, just make sure your heart doesn't. And I say that in a sense, you know, you're a giver at heart, but don't let motherfuckers walk all over you, nine of wands, just because they see more, just because they think you're more solid or more stable. Um, you know, you have your own kinks to work out here. And it's been a long time coming for somebody to be just thinking that they're going to be stopped here. This is personal addictions that someone could have been up against, or maybe this is someone with a personal addiction that is obsessing over you here and upset because you've over overcame obstacles and are making your way to a more positive realm, a, a more positive um, upper echelon experience of life here is what I'm getting. I'm gonna get this 10 of pinnacles here because, I mean, 10 of cups because we need to add it. And Ten of Cups, you guys, this is so amazing because this means that you outplay the evil here, okay? So this is your total wish fulfillment. As above is below, as they say, right? So basically, you have freed yourself, you know, from all things that are, how do I say this? With the 10 of cups, this is you doing it the right way and not just the right way. Like I said, there may have been some, there may be some times where you are offered things that aren't so clean or aren't so of the light or you are tempted. Like this is giving me extra marital affairs here. Like someone's trying to cheat on their family or cheat on their wife um, here because they see something magnetic in you or like there's chemistry between you that they cannot escape here. But I feel like, I don't know why this reading is turning this way, but this is why I promised what I'm getting. But I feel like somebody here is seeing you in a, in a light. Um, like somebody played games with you here. And somebody is, is still ready to risk it all here for you. The emperor. Spirit, clarify the devil and the magician. And this is somebody that is no good for you. This is spell work. Oh my God, Aries. This is fucking spell work. The devil and the magician. 
somebody is obsessed with you. Things are getting better for you. You're distancing yourself. You have boundaries up. You're not the one in your head. They are queen of pentacles. You're in your bag. Five of Swords, somebody is big mad. Why the fuck does this always happen in your readings? Somebody is so upset that they were not able to paint you out to be something clearly that you are not. Um, you are not a, a low life. You are an emperor or an empress. Um, it's like somebody has been not not only saying bad things about you, wishing bad on you. This is someone wishing bad that you don't succeed, that you don't go far. Um, this is someone that could physically be trying to harm you as well here. Um, this is just clearly somebody that's trying to win for the moment. It's a cheap victory. Um, it's a cop out. This person is beneath you. <clears throat> and this is a, a scum here. All right, Queen of Pentacles is what you will remain collective here. One more to close the reading out, Spirit. <clears throat> this is one-sidedness. I mean, this could be one person, but for some reason, I feel like it's multiple people. It's like when, when I mentioned earlier, somebody has gone to war and earn their stars and, and their stripes here. And Aries, this is you. Whatever comes up against you, Hermit Energy, Virgo, you take it out. For me, this is like all these people coming up against you here. You're still gonna be abundant. You're still gonna have plenty of options, plenty of opportunities, plenty of choices, abundant ones. Okay, stay in the Hermit Energy, Virgo. Fly above all of this bullshit, all right? This could have been somebody that literally ghosted you in a situation, a partnership, a friendship. Just somebody who doesn't play fair. This is a, a dirty energy here. Somebody that's sneaky um, and somebody that's definitely not good for your health, but you are doing right. Just like I mentioned in a previous reading, there's a star inside of this lantern that is waiting to come out. Okay, and change the world. And nothing is going to stop that. Not even these devilish bastards down here, Aries. You know I don't play that. <laughs> All right, I love you guys. And return to sender. No evil shall prosper over this way, okay? Hit that like and subscribe button for more messages from me. And oh, I forgot, guys. I'm doing a giveaway. I've decided. Two lucky subscribers. Um, you have to be subscribed to the channel. I'm going to announce when we're going to do the start date for it. But two lucky subscribers, I'm going to give you guys um, two different packages. Just my gratitude. It's a new year or we start in the 2023 season. New year doesn't start until Aries season. So just um, stay tuned. Check the community posts and make sure you're watching the reading so you can get updates. So I want to make sure I get everybody's name in this drawing. Okay, so I'll catch you guys later. Ciao.